Let's review how to manage the ECG record. When you complete this section, you will be able to locate the record in File Manager, print a directory of records, transmit records to a MUSE system or fax machine, and select, print, edit, delete, and display records. Turn the system on. If you're sending ECG records to a MUSE system for storage or faxing to a fax machine, you will want to transmit the records at some point. Press More until you locate Main Menu. Then press More again until you locate File Manager. Before transmitting, print a file directory which is a list of all ECG records stored in the system. You can use the directory to compare with the edit list on the MUSE system and double-check that all records were successfully transmitted. To select records for transmitting, press either Select to send individual records or press Select All to send all records on the list. Let's select individual records. Press F1. The first record is already highlighted. Notice that it is shaded in white. To select that record, or any other record, you first use the white cursor to highlight it, then press Enter. Notice the selected record is now shaded in gray, and the white cursor has moved to the next line. Use the arrow keys to move the white cursor up and down in the list, and select one or multiple records. Remember, the selected records to be transmitted are those shaded in gray. Select F4 for Transmit. The transmit method and destination, which could be by LAN or modem connection, will be predefined in System Setup. Once you press Transmit, the files are sent automatically. In addition to transmitting, once you select a record, you can also print, edit, display, or delete it. To print, Simply select the record or records and press Print. If you like, you can press Report Setup to change the format of the printed report. Refer to your operator's manual or clinical reference guide for additional information on using Report Setup. You can also edit on the Mac 5500. If you are transmitting to the MUSE system, you'll want to make sure the patient name and medical record number are corrected before the record is transmitted to the MUSE. To edit, select the records for editing and press Edit. Select what you want to edit. To close out of an edit screen and return to the Edit Item list, highlight Return and press Enter. To close out of an edit screen and return to the File Manager, press the Escape key. Editing a screen will require that you save the edited information by pressing Store. Pressing Display will place the selected ECG on the display screen for review. To return to the File Manager, press Return. A password is required to delete files. Highlight the records to delete and press Delete. Then type in the password. Please refer to the Operator's Manual or the Clinical Reference Guide for a more in-depth explanation of assigning a password and all features associated with the Mac 5500. Records displayed in the File Manager are saved to internal memory on the Mac 5500. However, if your LAN or modem connections are not functional, you can copy all patient records in the file manager down to a secure digital card. First, make sure a secure digital card is placed in the secure digital card slot at the back of the unit. From File Manager, select More, and then press Copy All. All the records will be copied down to the card. You can now remove the card from the Mac 5500 and download the records to the MUSE system through a secure digital card reader. It's important to understand that all existing records on the secure digital card will be overwritten when you perform the copy function. If you wish to keep records on this secure digital card, we recommend you use another card that has no existing records on it. 
You can also take records stored on a secure digital card and restore them back to the Mac 5500 file manager. First, take the secure digital card that contains the records and place it into the secure digital card slot at the back of the Mac 5500. From the file manager, select More, and then press Select and Restore All. We should note here that you must transmit all records on the Mac 5500 to Muse before restoring records from a secure digital card, because when you restore records from a secure digital card back to the file manager, all records currently existing on the file manager are erased. This concludes the Mac 5500 video. I hope it has given you an understanding of the system. On behalf of GE Healthcare and the Clinical Application Support Team, I would like to thank you for taking time to view this video. You are a valued customer to GE, and your satisfaction is important to us.